What is going on everyone and welcome guys to a brand new Clash of Clans video up on the channel. That's right guys. Thank you all so much for tuning in and thank you guys for the support on my recent videos. I know it's a big big change for me to start doing Clash of Clans content but guys I am so excited to be doing this and to continue doing Clash content. This should be a pretty fun video and I'm also very excited for the next video actually coming out tomorrow but for today's video guys Guys, we got some amazing content to go over for you all. I'm really excited and we're also going to talk about the future of the channel and some things that I'm going to ask from all of you. But let's jump right into it. So guys, I did just complete a builder. Actually, one of my builders is completely free now and I'm going to be using that to my advantage. So one thing I want to notice here is that these Electro Dragons are going to be fully upgraded to level 2 in 2 days. So I don't want to use up all of my Elixir here because I'm going to of course want to use as much of that to try and upgrade to the level 3 Electro Dragon. I'm very excited for that but instead what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to be upgrading my Archer Queen. Guys, she's going to take 195,000 Dark Elixir. We're going to be maxing her out for Town Hall 11. The reason I'm very, very excited is because not only are we maxing out the Archer Queen, but tomorrow, in tomorrow's video, we're going to actually begin the upgrade for Town Hall 12, hopefully. But before we can even begin that, of course, we do need 9.5 million gold. That's a lot of gold, and I already have quite a bit of it here, almost 7.5 million gold. I'm hoping in today's video to get to about 8.5 or 9 million gold, so we're going to, of course, do a couple of tacks. But before I can even upgrade our town hall, we need to get these 25 wall segments just built. I don't really care about upgrading them at the moment, so let's build them right along the outside here. We're going to take them all, and we're going to slap them up along the side somewhere. I got to find a good side here. I'm going to leave them as is, which is perfectly fine. Now we have the ability to upgrade to level 12, but before, of course, we do that tomorrow, I'll go over a few things that we're going to be unlocking with the upgrade. Not a huge upgrade to level 12 Town Hall, but Town Hall 13 is going to be by far the biggest upgrade we're going to have for a little while. We're going to be getting the Workshop. We're going to be getting a new Hidden Tesla, an Inferno Tower, two more Spring Traps, a Giant Bomb, the Air Bomb, and the Seeking Air Mine. So not a crazy upgrade, but at least it does open us up to, I believe, upgrading the walls one more level after this. Let's check. Yep, you need to upgrade your Town Hall to level 12 to upgrade these walls. So I really, really do enjoy the look of the level 13 wall segments. But for now, like I said, guys, we're going to be upgrading our Archer Queen over here. So let's start the upgrade for that. That's going to be a six and a half day upgrade. Very, very long and quite a bit of Dark Elixir. But we're going to go for it, guys. This is going to be a huge upgrade from what we were at, what we were doing. And I'm very, very excited because we also have some money in the treasury. We have 900,000 of each gold and elixir and almost 3,000 dark elixir. I don't really care about the dark elixir, but guys, since now that we've upgraded everything on this map, we're going to go over to our builder base, collect the gold, collect the elixir. We're going to start our boost here and we're going to actually start a new building. So we're trying to work our way up from the bottom. I'm actually going to be upgrading the wall segment first because this is the last level three to level four wall segment that I needed. Now we can work on upgrading actually these wall segments from level four to level five, but I'm not going to start working on that today. Like I said, guys, we're going to start from the lowest here we're gonna start with the mine and there's five of them gonna have to work on upgrading so we're just gonna work on the one for now and we will get our final attack in in today's video hopefully but first we're gonna have to jump over here I like I said guys I really want to work on getting that next upgrade and ready for the town hall so let's see if we can get to the 9.5 million gold that we need to actually start it let's hop right into a match guys and i'll see you when i'm there wow guys first base we got to literally the first base it's a big big loot base and so we're just going to start by putting down a couple of these baby dragons but we do want to work on getting at least the 50 percent so i'm also going to be using all of my troops today for this attack so i'm noticing that there is a gold storage right here. There's also a gold storage up here. 
and there's two gold storages down here. Now I'm considering going for these because these might just be the easier ones to go to, but maybe we can get all of them at once. So we're going to go for these bottom three actually, right over here. Spam that a little bit. Use a rage spell there, rage spell there, rage spell right over there. Yeah, kind of encompasses the entire area. We're also going to use a healing spell on this troop. See if we can maybe heal up that baby dragon. Nope, he's donezo. But maybe we can get this. Oh, come on, boys. Come on. Let's do it. Let's do it. I don't even think we're going to get the 50%, guys. I'm not too hopeful here because they are getting taken out really, really quick. And that's okay. Honestly, we can gap... We can get that back with our next attack. 45%, maybe they can, no. Oh no, all right, that's perfectly fine. We weren't able to get that, but we did get almost 800,000 gold and 400 plus thousand elixir. As always, I can't complain for the loot that I did get, but it is a little bit upsetting when I couldn't get as much as I wanted or I couldn't get the 50%. We are trying to, of course, always use up and get these star bonuses because of course we do get a pretty big reward that goes straight to our clan castle into the treasury guys so we're trying to get that but let's hop into one more match and then we'll hop over to our builder base here and do one final attack for the day guys i'm so excited for tomorrow to actually begin the upgrade for our town hall to level 12. very very big upgrade so let's hop right into our next match and so we found another player base that looks as if he hasn't been on in quite a few days. The elixir storages and gold storages look pretty full along with the gold and elixir collectors. So we're going to try and get this base done, but this is going to be a bit of a tougher one because of the placement of these air traps, these, these fireworks basically. Yeah, already that's going to be doing quite a bit of damage to my troop. Let's see if we can't just go straight for these collectors. Get rid of a couple on the outside here. Make a little room for our troops to get into the base. Get these out of the way as well. Try and get that 50% alongside it. Alrighty, awesome, awesome. They're moving in, but they're getting taken out pretty quick here. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Alright, guys, so the method actually that I'm going to go with is to pop a whole bunch down over here and then pop the rest down over here. Rage both of them up. Heal this one, heal this side, and we're also going to throw our Barbarian King right down here with a heal spell. I should have placed the heal spell further in, but we're going to rage him out because we definitely want to get to that elixir, or that gold storage anyway, or that uh, that gold collector, sorry guys. Nice, they, we've got the 50%, he's just taking it out. Perfect, perfect. Looks like we got what we came for. We're going to end that battle with our one-star victory. It's almost 700,000 gold right there. Pretty darn good again. And now to finish off the video, guys, we're actually going to do one final attack on our builder base. So we're trying to get these troops upgraded. I really, really want to max out the minion and the baby dragon. That is my goal on this side of the map. I'm trying to get that for the builder base. But of course, on my normal base, I'm really trying to also upgrade these baby dragons as well. Their rage ability is so helpful in getting that 50% and with doing a ton of damage to different map segments. Guys, I'm so excited, but let's hop right into another match for the builder base. Alrighty, so this should be a pretty good one actually. Gonna pop down a couple of our troops around the outside, get a couple of points here. Free, free damage taken. And then what we're going to do is we're going to actually go right along here on the bottom, throwing down all of our troops basically. And I do see that this crusher is getting worked on. So what we're going to do is we're going to throw down our builder, rage him out right away, hoping that they can take out these cannons pretty quick so that they don't do too much damage to him. Definitely want to get rid of this cannon as well. There we go. We're going to get pretty far into this base. I am very, very confident we can actually get this, um, this main building here. Forget the name of it. <laughs> There we go, there we go. Come on, come on, can we get to the 70%? That's the goal here, guys, that's the goal. Max him out as he hits that crusher. Oh no, we raged him, but we didn't rage him quick enough, I guess. Oh, looks like we're stuck at 74% here. That's okay, guys, that's okay. We're gonna go see how this guy is doing in his attack and if we might beat him, actually. So this is looking, oh wow, we beat him. Look at that guys, third and final attack. We did get the victory, very, very good. I'm very happy about that. 
With that, guys, I'm going to end the video here. But like I said, tomorrow's video, we have just under 12 hours now, or just over 12 hours, sorry, until the giant bomb finishes. I hopefully will have over 9.5 million gold. And at that point, I'm going to be upgrading our town hall from level 11 to starting level 12. Guys, I'm so excited. Let me know in the comments section below what you guys want to see for future videos. Any challenges, any troop challenges, attacks, anything you guys want to see, let me know down below, guys, and I'll see if I can make a video out of it. As always, I love you guys so much. Thank you guys so much. Have a good one. Later. Peace.